We're here in Bacon Rind and um, dug a pit and here 55 centimeters down, we're finding that surface or layer. It did not propagate in our stability test, but it did break and we were able to see the old crystals and this is from, you know, early January. This is the same layer that produced an avalanche over in Sage that Dave saw a little over a week ago. Same layer that Doug was finding down in Cook City that had caused a lot of deep slab avalanches. For us today, we're not extremely worried, but in most other places, we've got more load over that layer. And we have more snow coming, and so we're really gonna be keeping an eye on that layer and seeing how it reacts as we continue to load it. So that was an ECTP, I think is either 23 or 24, and that's going right on that surface hoar layer. So on the other side, we weren't getting propagation. Right here, we're at an elevation of 9,000 feet, northwest aspect, Surface hoar is probably a little bit better preserved than it was, and we're getting propagation. And you can see we've got a lot of snow above that surface hoar layer, and any avalanche that's this deep is going to be bad news.